Once upon a time in 2014, Limeira, Brazil, had a small zoo called Zoo de Limeira. During the FIFA World Cup, the zoo welcomed three adorable puma cubs and named them after famous soccer stars, Pele, Ronaldo, and Zico. But little Pele faced tough times early on. At just three months old, he started having serious health problems. The zoo staff worked hard to help him, but it became clear they were struggling. Deep down, they hoped someone else could step in and give Pele the care he needed. Then one day, William and Marilyn visited the zoo. They had always dreamed of owning a big cat, but it seemed impossible. When they saw Pele, now eight months old, their hearts melted. He was sick and fragile, but they knew they had to help. Without hesitation, they offered to take Pele home. To their surprise, the zoo agreed. The couple understood it wouldn't be easy, but they were determined to give Pele the love and care he needed. Taking Pele home was just the start of their incredible journey. Caring for a wild animal came with its own set of challenges, and Pele had many health problems that needed constant care. Though his health improved after a long recovery, he remained smaller than a full-grown puma, only reaching about two-thirds of the usual size. The couple faced a new challenge, teaching Pele to live comfortably in their small apartment. Finding a trainer who was willing to work with a puma was nearly impossible. Determined to make things work, William and Marilyn adapted their one-bedroom apartment to fit Pele's needs. They turned their hallway into a cozy den and even added a tree for him to scratch. After a lot of searching, they found a brave dog trainer who agreed to help. With several training sessions, Pele learned 10 commands, but he needed a lot of exercise to stay healthy. Unlike at the zoo, where he had little space, Pele now wore a strong harness and enjoyed two daily walks, each lasting an hour. Though William and Marilyn knew Pele was gentle, not everyone shared their confidence. Animal activists raised alarms, arguing that Pele should be living in the wild. They worried that his wild instincts might kick in and become a risk to others. Despite these concerns, the couple believed that Pele couldn't make it in the wild and were dedicated to giving him the best life they could. The legality of keeping a wild animal like Pele raised some eyebrows. Despite this, William created an Instagram account for Pele the Puma, and the controversy didn't stop him from winning hearts. Pele quickly gathered a huge following with over 2 million Instagram followers and 2.41 million YouTube subscribers. His videos, showing playful moments like exercising with William or splashing around in a bath, captured the affection of viewers worldwide. Now two years old, Pele still faces health challenges from his early neglect. He deals with muscle atrophy and rickets, so he needs regular vitamin and mineral supplements. Pele also walks with a slight limp and needs frequent checkups to monitor his health. Interestingly, Pele's name was inspired by the famous soccer player Edson Arantes do Nascimento, even though William and Marilyn weren't soccer fans before adopting him. After welcoming Pele into their lives, they became passionate supporters of the Brazilian soccer team, all thanks to their beloved Puma. Caring for Pele is more than just a full-time job. It's also quite costly. On average, pet owners spend around $1,285 annually on their pets, and Americans alone spend a whopping $70 billion each year. For William and Marilyn, taking care of Pele costs between 2,000 and 4,000 Brazilian real, about $350, $700 every month, just for his food. Pele enjoys a diet of raw turkey, beef, and chicken, and the couple also faces hefty vet bills. To make Pele feel at home, William and Marilyn have gone the extra mile. Pele loves playing with empty bottles, balls, and a special miniature soccer ball given to him by a Brazilian journalist. His apartment features a custom climbing nook and a mirrored wall that entertains him. Sometimes, Pele sits by the mirror, looking thoughtful while Reflection from Mulan plays softly in the background. It may sound surprising, but the dog training classes that William and Marilyn enrolled Pele in have really paid off. Despite being a puma, Pele has learned 10 commands, and they're still adding more to his list. He's gotten so used to walking in a harness that he rarely pulls on the leash. Not only is his training going well, but he's also made friends with the neighborhood dogs. The other dogs have taken a liking to Pele and have no problems with him joining their playtime. Pele's training goes beyond just walking nicely. William and Marilyn have also house trained him, which is quite an achievement for a wild animal. When they go on walks or short trips, 
Pele prefers to do his business outside. But when they can't take him out, he's been trained to use the bathtub as his special spot. Interestingly, this is the same bathtub where Pele sits calmly during bath time, making it a familiar and comfortable place for him. When Pele first came to live with William and Marilyn, he was calm but not very affectionate. Over time, he has grown closer to them and started behaving more like a typical house cat. Pele now loves being stroked, especially behind his ears. Although he has his own cat bed, he often chooses to snuggle with William in their bed. Pele has even learned to retract his claws when jumping onto the bed, showing just how comfortable he has become with his human family. Having a large cat like Pele has brought unique challenges to William and Marilyn's lives. Their vacation plans are now limited to nearby destinations they can drive to, but they've become experts at finding pet-friendly hotels that welcome Pele. William, who works at a local printing house, no longer has the freedom to go out for drinks with his friends after work because he needs to walk Pele. These adjustments are similar to those faced by anyone with dogs or children, showing how much Pele has become a central part of their family. Pele is generally friendly and has never shown aggression towards humans, but he can be cautious around certain animals. For example, he tends to be wary of larger creatures that make unfamiliar noises. This became clear when William and Marilyn took Pele to a farm with cows. Although Pele kept a close watch on the cows, he was no threat to them. He simply observed until they moved away. Unfortunately, Pele's relationship with William and Marilyn's other cat, Mira, isn't as smooth. Mira hisses and tries to scratch Pele whenever he tries to play with her. To avoid any fights, William and Marilyn keep the two cats separated while indoors. Despite his fame as a social media star, Pele remains down to earth and doesn't expect special treatment. He doesn't get jealous when Mira gets attention, which Marilyn appreciates. The couple is thankful that Pele doesn't have extravagant demands, as caring for a puma is already a major responsibility. However, they plan to move to a larger house in the future to give their cats more space. They even dream of adopting a leopard as a companion for Pele. Even though they know this might attract some criticism, their main goal is to ensure Pele has the best life possible. William and Marilyn's journey with Pele has been full of hurdles, but their love and commitment have helped him thrive. From rescuing a sick cub to raising a beloved social media star, their story highlights the deep bond that can form between humans and animals, no matter how wild they might be. For now, Pele enjoys a life rich with affection, care, and adventure, making him a cherished member of their family. So, that's all for today. What are your thoughts about this story? Tell us in the comment section below, and if you like this, make sure to like and subscribe. Your support means so much to us. Until then, take care, and thanks for watching.